Corinne Koning is charged with felony DUI in connection with the death of Nancy Moore Thurman. Police reports show she had a blood alcohol level of 0.16, well above 0.1, the legal definition of drunk. Koning is innocent until proven guilty, but a bill approved by the House Judiciary Committee would immediately take away the driver's license of Koning or anyone else found blowing over 0.15. Bill sponsor Morgan Martin says this will do a lot to deter drinking and driving. And uh, it's been shown that you got to get people's attention and the quickest way to do that is with a driver's license. Drunk drivers would lose their license for 90 days. Those under 21 would only have to blow a .04 before losing their license. Defense attorney Reese Joy says that isn't right. We need to have mandatory driver education. We need to teach our young people how to handle alcohol safely, and that nobody is, uh, is looking at. The legislation also requires that law enforcement videotape the entire breath testing process, a process which can take up to 45 minutes. The bill now goes to the full house where debate could center on whether it's right to take away someone's license who may have blown a .15, but who has yet to have their day in court. John Bernelli, 25, live.